Trump campaigned in three states and again questioned Clinton's health and her ability to handle the rigors of the presidency. Vlad, at one point, Trump suggested that Clinton is simply not well enough to handle a robust campaign schedule, saying, quote, she can't even make it to her car. Major, at his rallies on Tuesday and Wednesday, it seems like Trump's really been relitigating the Monday debate issue by issue. What's the strategy there? Well, just a couple of things, Vlad. One, to say, look, whatever you think happened, I feel good about it. I feel I represented you well. I represent change. Hillary Clinton doesn't. It was essentially a message designed not only to reassure his supporters, but also to tell Republicans very skittish about what they saw on Monday. Relax. We're going to be okay. This campaign has still got momentum. It's still got large crowds. And I'm going to go back and revisit some of the things to drive home the parts harder that I'd missed at the Monday debate in order to warm myself up for the next debate. But what Trump learned on Monday and what his supporters saw, much to their dismay, is that there is a huge difference, a yawning gap between ripping your opponent in a campaign speech in front of an adoring crowd when that opponent is not right across the stage from you and doing it face to face. Trump did not do that Monday, and if he does it at the next debate, he's going to have to be better rehearsed and better prepared. Mm.